Boo. <laughs> We're back in the haunted house. <laughs> um, it's day 189. <laughs> I gotta fix this light situation soon. Because this light bulb is like really hot, you know? It produces a lot of heat in summer. Alright. Yeah, that's cute. As you can see, my rating dropped a little bit. That's because I did one of those, like, let's play chess. Oh, this guy. Alright, I think I break. At least that's what I did in the past and it worked out for me, so. No reason to do anything different. I just think he's passive, you know what I'm saying? I almost just want to take him, but like. Eh, I don't need to. I don't need to. I'm going to provoke the a6, b5 weaknesses and then like push a4 later. So it's covered. Meanwhile, his knight is like suffocating his bishop. Like, if I were to trade, I think I make life a little easier for him. I could sack this guy. I mean, it's honestly a little tempting. But I don't need to. Yeah, I could. I could sack, but... Eh. Let's double up, let's double up. Yeah, it's gonna take, we're gonna open up the A file. Okay. Okay. Let's get out of here. A four e five, something like this. A four a five. A four, baby, let's go. He doesn't even try to fix a situation, so we're just gonna bust. We're gonna bust. Um, let's get out of the way. Yeah, is it still gonna come? Kick him away. I challenged this bishop a little bit. Also, there's no one defending him. If he comes here, I guess I can just block like that. But then this. Yeah, it's not ideal. It's not ideal. Let's make our way over. So slow. Let's get this guy over.
Gotta kind of hurry up a little bit. Because, like... I mean, there's no rush. There is no rush. But I don't know what that's about. I don't know. And... I don't really care. Let's keep going. Something like that. Paying for tugs right now. I don't know where he's going. I don't know. I don't know. Something like that. It's tasty. And then this is tasty. So I'm actually glad that he's like not exchanging. I thought the knight was doing a good defensive job over there, but he's trying to be fancy. So go ahead, we're gonna throw in a maiden one. And I mean, this doesn't come with Chuck, so I guess whatever he does here, I'm just gonna apply this um, to further my attack. The fielding. Like this. This, this. This, this. This now, this. I'm not sure, but this, this. This. Eh, I mean, I think life is good for me. If they go here, yeah, I can just take. So. I think he should have just taken my bishop because he didn't think this attack was going to come for him. He didn't see this attack coming for him. Alright, this. I think I need one more guy. What do you say? I think I need another guy over here. Like, possibly another guy. Possibly like that? If I can get there, I mean, that's very fancy. If I go here, he takes. If I go here, he takes. If I go here, and then he takes. Well, yeah, I guess he can't take because my rook covers. So this, boom, but then this, he blocked. This is kind of a problem. This, I guess, I just want to get up in here. It's a nice outpost. Hmm. I could also, like, do a rook left over. No, it takes. I just take. I remove a defender. And then I position another thing over here yeah that could also work i'll just throw a whole rook into the picture but if king moves out of the way then i'm kind of like then i kind of am a little stuck what do you say Yeah, I really want another attacker to join the party. What about this? And then yeah, maybe I can maybe I can do this, you know. Yeah, I'm gonna get my knight over here. Yeah, that's actually okay. I finally found a solution, but it just took me way too long. Yeah, I will still be attacking this, but I'll do it from this square. It just I didn't wanna risk getting losing these pawns and having like activating that bishop so we're gonna like just maneuver back because i'm also assuming the king is gonna get out of the way oops let's not do that right even if the king moves out of the way now i'm gonna first do a hit on the queen which then releases a square for the bishop to maneuver back into and then i have a really sexy outpost for my knight so uh this is gonna come i think they're gonna do this no oh 
Uh, and this, right? Yeah. Either way, something sexy is going to land on one of these squares. Yeah. They traded off their bishop for a knight so early, but we're going to claim that. Ha ha. Ha ha. We have the sexy knights. Ha ha. Sexy night time. Yes. Sexy night time. Let's go. Can I take this pawn is a question. Is that too greedy? But are they going to hit me with something? I mean, I don't think so. I think I'm good. Let's take this. We've been. <laughs> Listen, I was like, you took my bishop on like the third move. You open up the A file for me. Let's use it. Let's use that A file. All right. Let's claim something here. Next up is something like that. Hitting the bishop. Bishop takes, take this. Oh, well, I guess that's just a trade. It's just a trade, so let's not be hasty. Let's not be hasty. Okay. So I am up a pawn. Right? I am up a pawn. The question is, do I want to continue? I mean, I think I'm just better. So just ask for a trade. Is this still going to come? Oh, posture. <laughs> posture, excuse me. Oh my god. Oh my god, really? Huh, really? I mean, I don't know, this is definitely still coming for you. This is still definitely coming. I'm not going to try to spend so much time figuring out the intricacies here, but uh, I mean, these will be all weak. Oh, this is still coming. Ah, oh, my knight is too sexy. Yeah, let's play a little faster. Just a little bit. He was worried at the end of this line, like me taking, but I don't think that was actually a concern. I don't think that was actually a thing. Takes, 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 kind of just even. Yeah, but then this. Is he claiming I'm going to be trapped here? I don't think so. Did you overlook this or am I, I can just come back, right? I mean, oh no, the queen protects us, shit. So I'm just gonna give it up. I'm just gonna give up this. 
give up my rook for free. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. Okay, but now I can take it, right? Thank you. Gracias. This check is coming. Hot damn. That was the wrong square for the king queen for sure. I thought she was going to come down here. But now this check would win the queen, so be careful. Be careful. This would lose to mate. Just let me mate you already. Come on. <laughs> let me mate you already. I'm a simple girl. Hmm. She don't want mate. Are there any tactics here? This maybe? Maybe there's some back rank things. Maybe I should double up rooks. But both everything on like dark squares or light squares, sorry, may be nice for me. Yeah, how about let's go for back rank? Let's double up rooks. Yummy. Yeah, let's do that. This knight is so sexy. It's too much. Need your mice. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't even have wasted a tempo. Maybe I should have just doubled up. Because if I doubled up, they take, right? Chuck, boom. Chuck, that's mate. So I should have just doubled up. I didn't really see it until now. Okay, I didn't see, like, after the king moves h8, he's kind of vulnerable. Okay, um, she's still thinking of, she's still thinking of, like, protecting the pawns and stuff. I think now I have bigger problems in the air. Yeah, you want to create some loft, reasonable. But this is a fork. So let's use a sexy knight, yeah? Let's not use a sexy knight. Let's be up in exchange. Kind of gave up on the maiden one threat. We're not going to fall for it, so we're just going to go up in exchange. And what is up? Now let's get rid of you. I want to get rid of this knight. Well, this... Let's pass the queen. Let's be careful of this guy though. Oh, I see. Do I see? Um, he's learning some stuff. I want to go for this checkmate. I control this luckily. Let's create some loft for our own king. Let's not get crazy. She can take all my pawns, but I really want to go for mate. So that's my idea. Yeah. That's my idea. Take my pawns, please. Okay. I think you're forced to take, and this will be mate. GG. You have much more time than me, dude. You could kind of think this out a little bit, could you not? Let's not try to think this out a little bit. Good job. Yeah. Oh, fuck, it's a pin. Bro, I can't believe I got myself pinned. I can't believe I got myself pinned. This is so disgusting. I can't believe it. This is still mate, but um, why, motherfuck? He can't do this because I take that. Let's go here and up. Yep. What? You can't. I was like, I was like, why is this not Chuck mate? Oh shit! I only have nine seconds left. Hold on. Oh, that was amazing. I was like. Okay, because of the lag in the internet, I was like, why is it not checkmate? Why is it not checkmate? I was like, are you kidding me? This is not checkmate. It is checkmate. Thank God. Okay. <laughs> oh, it was a little... <laughs> I 
I always do that though. <laughs> yes. Okay. Nice. Some good positional play let you seize advantage in the middle game. Thank you, coach. Is his name David? I think, yeah. David. Thank you, coach David. David. Okay, so this is all book. This is book, but the best move is to drop back to e2, right? So I don't, so basically they don't take my knight away for free or a bishop. But you know what? I kind of just, um, Oh, we should have gone for g7. Interesting. Yeah. Force more concessions. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes. Yes. Push up pawn to freaking f6, man. That's why they push f6 themselves, to stop us from doing the same. Bro, what is this sack? What is this sack? That's insane. That's not even a sack. I guess the point is to release... Yeah, that's like some kind of cool tactic they have. Since we got out of the Chuck's way, we're having a double attack. They're claiming we can mess up their pawns a bit. Uh, for an advantage. Or I guess for equality. Okay, get rid of their annoying dark sword bishop. But I quite like, it tells us to trade it off, but I just, I don't know. I don't know if I already foresaw a future of some sexy nighttime, but, but I did. What? Oh my god, I can't believe I was going for sexy nighttime the whole time. It's because I didn't, to be frank, I did not see this sexy e6 square for me. I did not see the sexy e6 outpost until later on in the game when I'm like trying to maneuver my way back to it, remember? I was like, which, I was like, how does this knight get there, man? And then I was like, oh, this knight can come back. I frankly just missed it. And this is a huge mistake because it releases control of e6, which we later gobble up. So it is a mistake, but I wanted to just go for the obvious threat. And yeah, it still wants us to trade off. But at this point, yeah, it wants us to just come here anyway, right? I was just debating whether or not. I mean, let's let's check it out. Let's check it out. That's the best. And let's just check out this line. We just have a minor, minor little edge, but it's not even much. I thought they would just take it. Yeah, they would take our knight because it's just too sexy there. It's a little too gorge. And nothing much, because we don't even have checkmate. It's like, that's it. So I'm kind of glad I didn't go for that route, because it's kind of like not what I wanted to do. Okay, so we come for e6 this way. The queen comes here, so I have a hit on the queen, force an exchange of the bishop. So basically now I have control over these huge, sexy, light hole squares that they leave behind, because, yeah, they, 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 I, they basically sacked their... What am I even trying to say? They exchanged off their light sword bishop, which leaves these light hole weaknesses for me. So now I try to take advantage of it. Okay. Oh my god, so hot. So hot. Yeah, I thought that the queen move was a major weakness, but even before that, it says that we're already winning. Because that move was such a mistake. This move, I already saw them trying to play. But I thought, honestly, that they should have just traded, right? I thought they should have just, yeah, just trade. It's so simple. And it's still kind of even after that. But after c5, the problem is that they leave behind another weakness on d6. So not only do they have a huge weakness on e6, but also backwards unprotected pawn or soon to be unprotected pawn e6 or d6. One of those. <laughs> so we go after him. And yeah, already I should have seen the fork, and I don't. Either to double up or the fork. And now I play for it. So, kind of late, but better late than never. Yeah, I thought this was a little sketch. Um, already I should have gone for... First, this leaves my back rank open and kind of unprotected, which is why I had to waste another move for the left. And I thought that was like, you know, this is just a little freaky. I should have just immediately gone for this checkmate idea, which took me a while to see. Oh. Oh, the point being now this. And if they take, then this is also mate incoming, perhaps. And they take with a king. Let me see. Let me see. He wants this. Okay, let's check this out. This is a little sexy, and frankly, I don't really see it. Oh, I guess they just, they can ignore us. Okay, what if king takes? If king takes, 
This is just straight up mate, actually. Oops, not this, not this, because I need to control this. <laughs> Excuse me, jeez, maiden one. Did I miss that? Okay, cool. So if king takes, maiden one simply. Very nice. If pawn takes, then also maiden one. Very nice. And if queen takes here, I guess we just weaken the king a little bit. That's what we claim. We claim that we weaken the king. The back Ranko can prote be protected by our bishop. Although it is a little freaky to be honest, because yeah, after this, this, and then like this, uh, it is a little freaky. But I guess we're better because. I guess we can protect like that, yeah. Okay, that's too much for me to see in like one minute, I think. I'm not that skilled of a fast time control player to see that super quick. Okay. So yeah, all of this was like super sexy for me. I was like, oh yes, great. We removed the defender, now we're going for mate. I missed the crucial point that I'm pinning myself against the queen. But luckily for me, um, they also miss the fact. <coughs> oh, sorry, excuse me. Um, <laughs> they also miss the fact that this is mate. Yeah, great. Great. I'm really glad they missed it because if they had done this, I, don't, I just don't know. I don't want to convert this with nine seconds. <laughs> I would have lost. Great. Um. I think that was really fun. That was really fun. And maybe one more, or is that it? I'll be real, it is really hot. <laughs> it is really hot, but I did sleep a lot. Uh, I like napped after lunchtime. So I think I'm gonna play one more. The problem is like, yeah, it takes a while to upload these, so. I think I'm good, I think I'm good. Let's play one more. Oof. Uno mas. Uno mas and it's fan time. It's fan time. Sweating. Sweating. <laughs> nice. Wow, we get both d4, e4. Let's play this. And we're gonna quickly transpose because I feel boring. Good. They don't hit us with no Jobab and nonsense. I really wanna come out here, but I feel like that's boring. I just want to get out of the pawn chain more than this thing as a thing. Let's prevent the bishop from coming here too. So many little, little moves, you know. Do I want to do this? I don't know. Oh my god, yeah, you can sack. They're trying to tempt me to go here. Oh, they're being so sneaky. They're trying to tempt me to go b5 so they can sack the bishop. Uh, so let's just go here. Yeah. And now I'm threatening b5. So this queen has been a little misadventured. A little. Oh, so they don't. They actually ask us to go for this. So I will. Thank you. And already GG. Yes, hopefully. Yes. So I'm talking a little far from the mic, but I was saying that the queen is misadventured. And apparently, is this theory or what? Because, um, I don't know. I'm just going to, okay, show me what you got, because I'm just going to claim I'm better. <laughs> I'm going to claim I'm better. And I think I am. Hold on, before we let us develop naturally, let's not be lazy and think, can I actually trap the queen? I don't think so, but... I don't think so. I don't think I have a queen trap here. 
It's like one of those puzzles. Like, do I have a queen trap? Maybe I do. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Do I have a queen trap here? She pretty much- oh my god, I think I do. Hot damn. I think she is trapped. I think her royal highness is trapped. Not only you lost her bishop. I was so gonna just go for a natural developing move like bishop e e7. But I just try to like think a little harder. Yeah, you can't go here, 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 here. You can't go here, here, or here. Hot damn, you're trapped. Fuck yes. Fuck yes, mama. So sexy. So sexy. So fucking hot. Okay. Yes, I love it. That is what we want to do. We want to have that extra remaining 2% brain cell battery go like, Ding, 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 ding. Let's not be lazy. Let's try to th see if we have something a little bit more. Right? Like, let's go for a little bit more. Um. Okay, we got it. We got this. Internet. Yes, we got this, baby. We got this. Good opening knowledge let you exploit your opponent's positional misstep. I didn't know no openings, man. I simply just use my 2% brain. This is a little harsh. It claims that we have an extra 1,000 point advantage over our opponent, which I just... <laughs> it happens sometimes, okay? <laughs> I have blittered my queen away more times than I can count. Normally I don't do this. Yeah. Normally I don't do slow moves like this. I just do like developing moves, but this time, I didn't, because I wanted basically, the reason behind freaking a6 is because I wanted to get my bishop outside the pawn chain, and I wanted to then support this pawn with e6, but this always runs into this freaking bishop coming here, so I wanted to prevent that prophylactically with a6, although I guess that's not that big of a deal, because honestly, after they go back, I can just push the bishop back, I think. Let's see what happened if I go here. I think this is a move as well, although it's a bad move. <laughs> it's a bad move here. <laughs> like, immediately giving white a huge advantage. I think, yeah, because I don't think we can get the pawn back. We just lose the pawn in this. I don't know. Let me tell you, theory is not my thing. Yeah, the queen was too fancy. I think that's the whole problem. She came out here basically to go for this whole trick. I think that's the whole point of this move. The whole point is this trick. Right, let's just play that through for you so you can see why it's a blunder. Yeah, the point is I can't actually take the bishop. I can't take the bishop. Um. So yeah, but that's just a little too adventurous. And they especially fail to see the point of this whole move, which is to open up the latent diagonal. It's kind of hard to see, actually. With pawns in the way, it's hard to see the x-ray. But that's what tactics are based on. So let's go. And here I am so proud. I mean, a lot of people play Sicilians and stuff and like go for poison pawn variations, whatever, whatever. Know this trick really, really well. But for me, it's like, it's not ingrained into my intuition to see this tactical pattern. But I'm glad I took a step back to see. Um, it wants us to go here first. Why? Why is that necessary? Why can't I just trap the queen already? <laughs> Why can't I trap the queen already? Oh my god. Right? I think that is the best move. Why is this not the best move? The engine claims that, like, this is the best move. But then the queen can escape, no? I don't know. Who would rather Who would rather do this than take the queen? For real? For real, David? I, I beg to defer. All right, buenoche. 
very 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 happy evening to all of you from all over the world thank you guys so much thank you so much <laughs> i will see you tomorrow bye 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 bye